when you sit, you put more load through the lumbar spine, anywhere from 40 to 90% more load through the lumbar spine. When you bend, you significantly increase the load in the lumbar spine by changing the mechanics, straining this area. So basically you're saying, I've injured my lower back, and when I do stuff that puts more pressure on it, it hurts. Well, firstly, we need to actually be aware of the fact that that's what we're saying, right? That's really important. It's not a foregone conclusion. People don't realize that. You're not gonna find a way of gaming the system, right? It's injured, it needs to heal. It's injured so it cannot load bear as effectively as it could when it wasn't injured. So anything that's gonna increase the load, toler the load on that area is going to be a problem until we have built load tolerance back again. And so how do we build load tolerance? That's your rehabilitation. That's the rehab work. That's what you need to do. To re you need to use exercises like the squats, the hip hinges in particular to rebuild resilience into that lower back to strengthen the tissues that have been damaged that are currently intolerant to load. And over time, you will find you can do those things again. You'll find that sitting becomes painful after 10 minutes instead of five. That sitting becomes painful after 20 minutes instead of 10 minutes and so on and so forth. But that improvement in your symptoms comes from doing the rehab work. Your rehab takes your squat from body weight to five kilos, from body weight to 10 kilos, and you notice that those other things in the real world get easier. Very important. Well, firstly, we need to actually be aware of the fact that that's what we're saying, right? 